Hey, are you all right? What a nice day it's been. I'm just waiting on my pasta boil and I'm gonna make something quick for tea. I'm sat in the garden all day, I've not done much, but it's been really nice. Not even walk the dogs because it's been too warm. I'll take them out after. And I've made just like a Greek, well, it's two days before payday, so it's not gonna be anything too extravagant. So it's pasta, macaroni, and I had some feta cheese. So I'm gonna do like a Greek, Greek macaroni salad. It's gonna be nice, dead summery. I've drained the macaroni, it's still hot. Put it into a bowl. I want a bigger bowl, hang on. Into a big bowl. We're gonna make a dressing first and we're gonna put the dressing on the pasta while it's still hot. That way it absorbs all the flavors because it's still warm and we'll let it cool with the dressing on. So, get a jug. The zest of a lemon goes in there. I'm struggling not to sniff. I'm bothered with a bit of hair fever today. And I'm just sniffing all the time. Squeezing the juice of the lemon. I'm just getting the pips out first. Grating one clove of garlic. About two teaspoons of oregano. You can use parsley or dried basil as well. Got some extra virgin olive oil and we're going to pour some in. Bit of ground black pepper. You want about 100 mils of lemon juice to 200 mils of olive oil and it needs to be extra virgin olive oil. Good mix together and then what you have to do, you have to taste it otherwise you don't know it's nice. That's ground, that's nice just like that. If you think it needs more lemon, put more lemon in. If you think it needs more garlic, do that. Pour it over the pasta. Give it a good mix together so that all of that macaroni is coated in that lovely oil. And you can smell it as soon as it hits the warm pasta. It just smells lovely. Set it aside to cool. Get on with chopping some vegetables. I'm gonna slice up a red onion. I've got half a cucumber. I wish I had a full one, but I don't. So we just have to use this. I like to take a bit of the skin off because it's that skin that repeats on you. So I just take that much off, chop it up. You can scoop the seeds out if you want. I'm not gonna bother for this. Cherry tomatoes, what are these? Piccolato tomatoes, we're on offer in Aldi. But how nice are they? I'm gonna use all of them, I'm just gonna slice them in half. Put the vegetables in the dish. Break the onions up. Block of feta, we're gonna put the full block in. Just crumble it up. Now I haven't put any salt in and that's because feta cheese has got a salty flavour. So add salt afterwards as you like. Big spoon, mix it together. I've got a bag of rocket salad. I'm going to put a couple of handfuls of that in. And I'm going to give it just an extra glug of olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, and the last stir, and then I've got a nice bowl to put it in. I've also got some like flatbread, so I'm gonna put them in the toaster. Just tip it in, I'm hoping the bowl's big enough. But how nice, it smells gorgeous. How nice is that? I'm gonna put some olives on. I'm just gonna put them on the top just for Ian's benefit. I don't like them. So green or black olives, you do you. Stuffed or unstuffed. Flatbreads are in the toaster. Shop-bought hummus. I'm just gonna put it into a little bowl.
give it a little dust of paprika if you've got some doesn't matter if you haven't and then just a little drizzle of olive oil to make it look nice because no one has to know that you haven't made this flatbreads out the toaster chop them up into pieces Greek style macaroni salad with flatbreads and hummus deliciously simple and gorgeous how lovely Ian will never know that I've done nothing all day let's have a taste of this these flatbreads were just from where were they from these ones were from Lidl but you can get them in all the supermarkets now and they're nice a fork Could put a bit of that hummus on there and a bit of that cheese and a bit of tomato don't be asked for double dipping it's my tea mine i'm going to be eating it and ian doesn't care if a double dip that's nice give this a go don't be standing slaving over the cooker in this heat it's too warm just get something nice and simple made this kitchen's boiling i've only boiled a pan of pasta Anyway, have a great evening. Enjoy this beautiful weather. Don't be twining, it's too hot. Don't be doing that. We've waited long enough for it, especially up north. Get yourselves outside. If you get invited anywhere, how good would this be to take to a barbecue or a summer soiree? We'll have this tonight and tomorrow it'll get boxed up for packed lunches. So it's not going to get wasted. So don't say, oh, there's too much there use it for the next day make putting the gas on worth your while don't just cook one meal there's enough there for a couple of days enjoy your tea whatever you're having don't forget to like share and comment if you don't you might not see my post because facebook decide what you see not me so you vote with your finger bye bye